Welcome to our second Vlogmas. I don't even know if I can call my December vlogs like Vlogmas videos because I am pretty sure I'm only gonna have like three or four vlogs if I'm lucky. Anyway, I believe the first vlog has gone live the other day and I wanted to do another vlog. So today I have a day off, it is a Tuesday and I am gonna head to Bondi Shopping Centre and do some Christmas shopping, quite last minute. I'm gonna go to Chanel Cosmetics. Their packaging this year is so beautiful. And then while I'm there, maybe I will have a look at Prada because I haven't been in Prada for so long. Bondi has a lot of luxury stores. I don't know how much time I'll have to browse, but I want to really check out the crystal bags from Prada. And maybe I'll just duck into Louis Vuitton for a little bit too. And then I have a couple of packages coming today. So maybe I'll do a little mini unboxing as well. One is a pair of Jimmy Choo shoes that I've been waiting for over a week now. I think the shoes got held up somewhere in Germany. I ordered it from Farfetch. This video is not sponsored. It's just something that I bought a couple of weeks ago and then I've got another package that I've received recently that I want to open up with you guys as well so hopefully you enjoy what's in store for today's vlog and let's head out now there's an LB pop-up here at the moment which I'll go in and check out a bit later look how sparkly that bag is Keep on First of all, I'm just in Chanel Beauty to pick up some Christmas presents and oh my goodness, I am in love with the Christmas packaging, how sparkly. So that's what I'll be doing first. Christmas shopping. Let's now head into Prada and check out those crystal bags. Alright, right at the front of the store is this crystal clear bag in the black. And then I found the pink re-edition crystal bag this baby pink is really really gorgeous can you see how sparkly the crystals are but every time i buy a pink bag i just don't wear it the re-edition is actually really spacious inside i used to have a black one like a small bucket like this mm -hmm. but smaller it will be like that mm -hmm. but in this shape okay and the size is like like this um, do you have that in stock we don't have it oh I'll okay the photo. sure let's try it. oh my gosh i love this i love this sparkles inside is satin yeah well Head into the Louis Vuitton pop up store. Yeah, I've never seen this before. Oh my gosh, it's so sparkly. So you can just wear it this way if you want. I love versatility. Try the strap. Yes. Thank you. Keep on driving and driving along the road tonight. As my head of my back between the jars and bottle jug, just 
Mm. So let me do that one color color in there. Um, this is good value. <laughs> no, can I be honest? Like, I hate the word. Especially I, I know, I it's like such luxury, word. right? Yes, they are investments. I know. Yeah. Loosely. Oh my god, yes. <laughs> it's to evenly distribute the weight. Mm. So Big strap for like a small bag. <laughs> Really sparkly. Yeah. It's up shopping at Bondi, got the Christmas presents that I needed to get, then went to my weekly yoga session. It's become like a PT. Anyway, I sweated it out and I came home and I told you guys there were two packages that I was expecting today and I wanted to unbox them with you. And I'll quickly show you some of the Chanel goodies I picked up as Christmas presents. Also wanted to mention, I loved all the crystal bags from Prada, especially that pink one in the re-edition. That was so beautiful, but I just had to you know control myself because i don't really see myself ever really carrying that bag i mean it's so crystal and sparkly but the silhouette of the bag is very casual so is it meant to be a casual bag or is it a dressy bag especially in that baby pink color i just don't see myself using it so i left it although it was stunning the clear bag was really nice in the crystal as well but that bag was like four thousand something australian dollars and yeah definitely not spending that kind of money on a very occasional bag probably and you guys know i bought a couple of bags in the last month or so so i thought you know i'm just gonna leave them the louis vuitton pop-up store was beautiful and all those bags were so pretty as well but again for bags that are going to be probably very occasional use bags for me i just didn't think that i really needed them so yeah it was really really nice to show you guys around and for me to try on those beautiful bags but ultimately i decided against all of them i don't even know why i went in because i didn't really need them but they were just there so <laughs> i thought you know i'm just gonna go in and you know show you guys around but anyways, let me flip the camera around. All right, so we have everything that I want to show you. So first up is a very, very special package that I received from my gorgeous friend, Clara. She's also here on YouTube. Her channel name is Clara Zilla. Oh my goodness, babe. I cannot believe that you sent me such thoughtful gifts. So she actually texted me about a few weeks ago and told me that she is posting something to me, something small for Christmas. And you know, I was just like, babe, you don't have to. Oh my goodness. Anyway, so she sent me this beautiful package and I wanted to open it with you guys. If you're watching, babe, thank you so, so much. So first up, these are some really, really nice face masks. I mean, I, I think these are like eye masks. She just knew that my skin needed a little bit of TLC. And then we've got some face masks as well. I cannot wait to try them all. And then this is a beautiful little packaging in here. Let me get them out. Oh, it's a really nice velvety dust bag. I wonder what's inside and oh my goodness how cute is this little hair clip it looks really strong and really well made and I just love this beige color she just knows that I love the color beige and anything nude and I just love this brush gold claws oh my goodness thank you so much babe I actually was in need of a hair clip because my very cheap one from Chemist Warehouse broke the other day and I always clip my hair up after I have a shower. So thank you so much, babe. I am so excited to start trying this beautiful one. And oh my goodness, this is an Hermes Lip Enhancer. I absolutely love Hermes Lip Enhancers. So she got me the Rose Abricot. I am so excited to try these. I do have um, a darker shade, but I haven't tried this shade, so I can't wait to try. This looks like a really nice everyday sort of subtle color. 
and she actually also included the little Hermes bag. How cute. Thank you so much, Clara, for all of my goodies. I'm so excited to start using all of them. If you guys don't already know her channel, go over to Clara Zilla and check her channel out. She's got a really good luxury channel. And make sure you subscribe to her for great luxury content. And then... Well, I've got something from Farfetch as well. This is not sponsored, like I mentioned, but I wanted to open it with you because it's something that I've been eyeing for a little while. So I'm really, really excited for that. But before we get into that, I bought some Christmas gifts from Chanel Beauty and the packaging this year is just so beautiful. Look at this ribbon and the camellia. Aren't they just gorgeous? The Christmas colors, red and gold. And I just wanted to open one up and show you guys. So I took one out from its box and I just wanted to show you. Here we go. I took the lid off and might be a bit of a mess in there now because it's been sort of sitting vertically. But I got this very famous hand cream from Chanel. It's kind of a pricey hand cream. So it's something that we wouldn't often spend money on by ourselves, but it makes for a really nice present. So that is the beautiful egg hand cream I bought. I also put in the box the double facets mirror. So this is a very famous Chanel mirror as well. So one side is normal mirror and the other side is a magnified mirror. And the Lovely Cells Associate actually put some samples. So these three are samples. And then I also bought a Hydra Beauty Nutrition Lip Care as well. And then I asked the sales lady, do you think they're going to look too empty just with the three things in there? Because the box is so big and the smaller box was just too small. And then she said, oh, I'll put some samples and make it look really nice. So I love this sample. How beautiful is it? Oh, why is it open? I need to fix it. But anyway, inside is a tiny, teeny little Chanel number no. five perfume. Isn't it just so adorable? I'll fix it later, but look at this. Oh my goodness, it's so, so stinking cute. And then she got me a Hydra Beauty repair mask. And she also put in the other vitamin clay mask as well. So isn't this such a beautiful gift idea? I am obsessed. And now let's get into what we got from Farfetch. All right, here we have it. I'm so excited. I actually hope that the size is okay because it's a pair of shoes. Must have come from Zitkak. I believe it's a department store somewhere. I can't remember. Poland, I think it was. Anyway, let's get into it. It's from Jimmy Choo. Got it out of the Farfetch box. This must be all the paperwork. And Jimmy Choo dust bag. I do have a, another pair of Jimmy Choo shoes. I've got one pair of Jimmy Choo shoes in my collection. And I do love the quality of their shoes. So I was actually looking for something like this for a while. And when I saw this pair, I thought that's it. This is the one that I've been waiting for. Look, I picked up these pair of gold heeled mules in the size 38. So I'm going to just unwrap them and try them on for size. And hopefully the size is okay. So here is the right pair. How beautiful is this gold pair? Guys, you know, I noticed I didn't really have a lot of festive pairs of shoes. So I thought, you know, I would love a minimal looking gold pair of shoes, like strappy heels or something. And I've been actually looking for a pair for a little while, but I just didn't come across anything that I really loved. And then I saw this one pop up on Farfetch. And I just thought that is the perfect minimalistic look that I was going for. And you guys know that I do have my Gucci Dynasty Super Mini Bag. Let me just go grab it. Aren't they such a good match? Anyway, so when I picked up the Gucci Dinosaur's bag, I already had these shoes in mind. And this is such a minimal look that you could just dress up any of your dresses with these two little gold accents. And I'm not always one to match the color of the shoes to the bag. I think if you don't do it right, it can look a little old fashioned. But when it comes to the festive looks and black tie looks, I think coordinating the color of your bag to your shoes is really nice. So yes, I'm really excited about these pair of shoes. And I do have another Christmas party to go to this weekend, so I think I am going to maybe wear these 
And I'm just trying these on for size before I take the tag off because once you take that far-fetched tag off, you can't return them or exchange them for size. And they seem like the most perfect size. I'll show you a whole modeling look, but I don't look very cute at the moment with my outfit. So um, this will have to do. And I'm just stepping on a little rug because you're supposed to try these shoes on carpet. So the bottom doesn't mark up until you know you're keeping them. So yes, that's what they look like. And I brought the Gucci bag. Oh my goodness, I think this will be a very Instagrammable pair. They look amazing together. So yeah, can't wait to start wearing them all together. So I hope you guys are enjoying these very sporadic random vlogmas videos. Next week I'm heading to high tea and spa with my bestie at Shangri-La here in Sydney. I think it was Shangri-La my bestie booked this so I need to confirm I'm so bad. Uh, so I'm gonna try and vlog that a little bit. So I'm basically thinking you know whenever I do something a bit more interesting than just going to work I'll probably try and vlog that and share it with you guys because you really don't need to see my mundane day-to-day -day life. I don't have things happening every single day to do like a daily vlogmas thing. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. As always, thank you so much for watching and spending some of your precious time with me today. And I can't wait to see you again soon in my next video. Bye guys.